definitely hungry this morning and I definitely mangled my eggs. So I did five eggs again with some grass-fed butter and I also have the leftover um, sausage and peppers from last night that I didn't finish. For lunch today, I just had a cup of macadamias because the kids were sleeping when I got hungry and I don't ever want to make any noise in the kitchen when they're sleeping because I don't want to risk waking them up and ending my break short. <laughs> so I just made myself a cup of macadamias and I literally ate the whole cup. That's a lot of calories, but calories don't matter this week. I'm gonna definitely need to eat soon-ish. So I'm gonna shoot for like 3.30 or four o'clock for my early dinner. And then I have some clients this afternoon. And then when I get home, I'm gonna try to just not have anything. So my dinner needs to be enormous. I'll keep you posted on that. We got this shaved beef steak at Trader Joe's the other day because I just wanted to try something new. And I just opened it up and it's like, look at this, it's like paper thin. So I don't really know how I'm gonna cook it. So I'm just gonna throw it in a pan and see what happens. All right, so this is what I came up with. Um, I did put some olive oil on the eggplant just to make sure that there's some fat in there. And I have a sugar-free tomato sauce, olives, and I did put some salt on the eggplant because it's day two and I'm definitely feeling a little sluggish. I needed some salt. I don't know, I, heat, I heated the other one up. Maybe that made a difference? Maybe because it's been in the fridge for six months. <laughs> Anyway, this is all right. It's better than we expected, so pleasantly surprised. I've got my trusty almond butter, and I'll just put a little bit of cinnamon on top just to make it more like dessert, but not really. That's better than nothing, but it's really dry. <laughs> So I'm gonna need some almond milk to wash this down. And then that's it. I'm done for the day. And it's like four o'clock. So I have to make it through the next four hours with nothing. But I'll just have some tea or broth and I should be fine. There we go. I'm on my way to see some clients right now and actually one just one client and thank god because oh i haven't done a full cleanse i mean i've done all seven days but i've done modified which is just more carbs and easier for the last few times i've done it this time i am all in full cleanse and i'm feeling it i'm sluggish kind of tired kind of cranky i feel like i kind of just want to stay home and cry but I can't. Today is just kind of the rough day. It's almost over. I'm done eating for the day. A few more hours and I can go to bed and hopefully feel better tomorrow. <laughs> good morning, guys. It's day three. I feel pretty good. Um, I'm definitely, I don't know, like a little bit shaky. So I added some extra salt to my eggs this morning. Sorry, the kids are outside playing. My breakfast today is five eggs again with broccoli and butter and salt, of course. Full disclosure, so I just finished that breakfast and I don't know, I don't feel, oh, pop, no, no. I don't feel completely stuffed. So I'm gonna eat some cashews right now. You want a cashew? Yeah. Can I have a cashew? We're eating cashews, you want some? Yes. Mom, can I actually raise some cats using the bottle? Yeah. I'm gonna eat a cat. Okay. I meant some cashews too. For dinner, I am having salmon and asparagus. And I put some olive oil and salt and pepper on the asparagus. 
I don't know if I'm gonna be able to eat all of this. We'll see, I'm pretty hungry. I ate it all. Every last bite. I also added half an avocado. So way more than I thought I could do.